this mind among yourselves, which is yours in Christ Jesus, who, though he was in the form of God, did not count equality with God a thing to be grasped, but made himself nothing, taking the form of a servant, being born in the likeness of men, and being found in human form, he humbled himself by becoming obedient to the point of death, even death on a cross. Humility. Humility is not the me outer appearance of a person such as dressing in rough clothes, talking with a soft voice, or walking with a, a bowed head. Also, it is not merely expressed by words a person repeats to others saying that he is a sinner, wicked, and not worthy. Neither is it expressed by words one repeats to God declaring his triviality, humiliation, and spiritual poverty. Humility is the life one lives between himself and God, in which he feels he is nothing, even less than nothing, and whatever good or righteousness he has is from God, and without God he is but dust, darkness, and evil. Now humility of heart comes about in a person for two causes, either from precious knowledge of his sins or from recollection of the greatness of God. My Lord Jesus Christ, you humbled yourself and became man. Help me, Lord, to live the life of humility.